In this video, I'm going to demonstrate some of the object editing features in Screenshot Capture, objects like arrows and callouts and text boxes. The object editing tools are shown here in this toolbar. And here's the arrow tool. Let's add an arrow. And maybe we want to point to this area here. We just drag it from the source to the destination. And you can see when you choose an object, you've got general options that pop up in this sidebar. And we can add texts like here I am. And we can, of course, move this around. And what else could we do? Let's put a box around this to draw even more attention to it. And you can see we can change the transparency, change the shape. Now one of the important things with Screenshot Capture is that when you save an image with objects, you can come back to it and edit those objects later. So let's say I've saved it with a new name. And here it is. And here's my original. Let's go back to this one. And you can see that if I double click, I can now change the objects even after I've saved the image. Okay, let's turn that off. Let's come back and delete these objects. We don't need them. What else might we do? We might want to add a text box. Let's add a text box over here and say something like, this is from weather.com. And just adjust it a bit. We might put a shadow around the box and change the background color. No border. Okay, so that was the text call out. What else might we do? We might want to put some clip art on the image. Now, Screenshot Capture works by loading external directories full of clip art and it comes with quite a few sets and you can add your own sets. Uh, I like these numbers so if we go into this we might drag a number here somewhere. It starts out pretty big but we can reduce the size. Let's, if we were doing a series of screenshots we might mark this as number one. What else can we do from the object editing? We might add a caption like this is the view from Opera and there's a it's added a text box we can come back and edit that later if we want of course what else can we do you've seen the edges and frame effects I showed that earlier I guess that's a pretty good overview of the object editing features from screenshot capture